time now for Eyewitness News. Call 12 for action. A major baby products company recalls thousands of booster seats. And thousands of gas rangers are also being recalled after posing burn hazards to consumers. Consumer reporter Susan Hogan joins us now with the details. We found thousands of products being recalled this week, many of which caused injuries to consumers. OXO recalls Nest booster seats due to a fall hazard. The stitching on the restraint straps can loosen, which allows the straps to separate from the seat, posing a fall hazard to children. More than 25,000 booster seats are being recalled. The company received five reports of the stitching coming undone, releasing the straps. The recall involves the Nest booster seat in green, pink, or taupe, and were sold nationwide from September 2014 through April 2015. Electrolux is recalling certain model Kenmore Elite ranges due to a fire and burn hazard. These were sold exclusively at Sears. The burner flame can go out while the gas is still turned on, allowing gas to escape. The recall involves stainless steel slide-in ranges with gas cooktops and electric ranges and sold nationwide from June 2014 through October 2014. And Viking Range is recalling thousands of its gas ranges due to a burn hazard. The range ovens can turn on by themselves. Viking has received 75 reports of gas ranges turning on by themselves, including three reports of burns and four reports of property damage. Consumers should contact Viking to schedule a free in-home repair. While waiting for that free repair, consumers should contact Viking for steps to avoid burn injuries. We have a lot more information for you regarding these recalls, including model numbers and also company contact information. It's all on our website at WPRI.com. And if you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1, hotline 228-1850. Or if you're interested in becoming a Call 12 for Action volunteer with me, you can call that same number you see right there on your screen. I'm Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.